Good morning to the saints of North Creek and the saints well beyond. Uh, we continue our daily Lenten devotion, and today we're going back into the Beatitudes that are found in the fifth chapter of the Gospel of St. Matthew. Let me begin again with the fifth chapter and get up to the uh, third Beatitude that I want to use as a devotional this morning. We start at uh, chapter 5, verse 1, when Jesus saw the crowds, he went up to the mountains, and after he sat down, his disciples came to him. Then he began to speak and taught them, saying, Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are those who mourn, for they will be comforted. Blessed are the meek, for they will inherit the earth. May the Lord add a blessing to the reading of the word. Amen. So often when we hear of someone being meek, we think of uh, someone cowardly. We think of someone who's afraid to speak their own voice. They're afraid of what other people are going to say about them. They are timid. They're like a little mouse cowered in a corner somewhere. And that's not what the scripture is about. The word that has been translated meek from the Greek, it means power and courage with restraint. And that is how we are to, to be able to uh, to associate, to have build relationships. That's how we're supposed to be able to bring people together. And, and that's what we see the greatest example of meekness. We see it in the man on the cross with Jesus on Golgotha. We see the man of perfect courage and perfect faith. We see the man of perfect strength and wisdom and, and grace and forgiveness of unconditional love, of self-giving, and yet enough power within to turn himself over even to his enemies in order to save them. Now, that is a, 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 less, a lesson for the season of Lent that we need to be thinking about. How can I take this courage and strength and put it in restraint? How can I have that forgiveness, that unconditional love? Even when people mistreat me and when, when they seem to want to take my power away from me, how can I wrap my arms around them and give them the love that God would want me to give? Courage, power, restraint. Blessed are the meek. They shall inherit the earth. Amen.